The Cape May Crud. All right, I got a question about this, this so-called Cape May Crud. Do you get sick while you're at boot camp? Uh, in my experience, yes, <laughs> you do get sick. Um, there was a question about the vaccines that you get and I will actually leave a comment down below with a link. I found this website that you can put in your specific information and it'll give you a rough idea of what vaccines you will likely need and will be getting when you're at whatever military boot camp you're going to. It's just armed forces and it's not specific to Coast Guard. So that could be helpful because I did have a question about what vaccines do you get. But the Cape May crud, yes, that definitely happened. It happened when we got our shots. And I think this was like week three, week four, I don't remember exactly when. But we were in a long line and smallpox was one of the shots that we got along with whatever other shots they felt you needed. And I, I got about 13 or 14 pricks, I, I feel like. And everybody had a specific order. So some people went up there and got three. Some people went up there and got eight. But they did it really fast. It literally was like they line you up and they go to your shoulder and just bing, 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 bing. I still have some of the scar tissue of the shots, the, the smallpox specifically. That, that thing leaves a mark. Um, it is freezing right now. I'm not going to take off my shirt and show you. But maybe in a future video, uh, I'll, I'll show the, the scar. But... Uh, Yes, the Cape May crud arrived shortly after that. Um, whatever, whatever. I, d I don't know if it was specifically related to the vaccines or, maybe, or if it was just a correlation and not a causation, but I remember a couple people getting sick and then I remember more people getting sick and then I remember everybody getting sick. And I remember the squad bay feeling like a cesspool of just germs and sniffling and sneezing, sneezing and coughing and body aches and it sucked it definitely really sucked um this was years i'm i'm old like this was a long time before covid um i can only imagine during uh covid that that would be a whole nother and maybe they maybe they approach that differently now because it's it, it, it is so much more strict in terms of like where you can go if you're coughing obviously but yes, the Cape May crud, it was a thing. And I think that it's fairly universal. Um, I think that just by the laws of numbers, uh, you have 40 to 50 or more people crammed into a conclosed area together over the course of eight weeks. Somebody's going to catch something and it's going to go around. And that's just the reality of that of that world so yeah um it, it'll probably happen and as i always say it's okay expect it um obviously don't don't ignore if you're really sick and something's really wrong i mean get it checked out go to, go to medical tell your cc's um but uh you know when you're there just you know listen to your body and um you know, you'll, you'll, you'll get, you'll get through it. You'll be all right. Anyway, uh, any specific questions on that subject or any others, please let me know in the comments down below and I will answer the best of my abilities. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.